CBS 42 News reporter Mike McClanahan live with us tonight from Montgomery with what this means for Governor Robert Bentley. Mike? Well, Jim, it's still a little bit confusing now. The House did amend the rules of its own impeachment proceedings within just the last 30 minutes. And because it's just a House rules change, it does not require Senate approval. But what exactly that means for the governor is a little bit cloudy. Here's the thing. The bill's sponsor told us earlier that if the rules change passed, that would automatically put the articles of impeachment in motion that have already been filed against the governor. But during the hours of debate on just the rules change alone, the actual number of votes required to bring those articles was changed. That means the person who sponsored those in that first impeachment push, Representative Ed Henry, would need more votes now to make that happen. There were a couple of changes that I didn't agree with, but I, I think the, the resolution has remained largely intact from uh, what was brought, and, and I think it's a stronger, stronger resolution than it was before the process began. Now, of course, we are running out of time in this legislative session. Some said tonight might be too late if this did not pass. So is the impeachment push dead? Well, some lawmakers are telling me yes. Representative Friday there clearly is not convinced that this effort is completely over. He thinks there's still a chance that it could move forward. At this point, we haven't heard how the governor will respond to this rules change. Live in Montgomery, Mike McClanahan, CBS 42 News.